Yo guys, before this video does start, check out Fast Hut Coins for the fastest, cheapest, and most reliable NHL 21 coins out there. If you use code PADDY, you get 5% off your order. Cheapest prices, it's the best way to get coins if you're looking to buy some. Again, enjoy the video, boys. Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Paddy Kills here. I am back with another NHL 21 Hockey Ultimate Team video. We have a big video today. First off, if these packs look good, if we can get 50 likes, let's say, okay, 30 likes, 30 likes or more, I'll do a pack opening. I will do a pack opening and I will open up a bunch of these packs. But these are the Black Friday promotion packs. I told you in yesterday's video, do not buy any packs. Save them for Black Friday. Look at this. We have some sick cards. We have the primetime double pack. Limit is four per 24 hours. The ultimate choice pack, Black Friday. Limit two per 24 hours. And obviously with a forever pack, which you can open up how, how, many, how many you want. Um, big packs and going over all those pack probabilities. We have some new prime times out right now. Um, the good thing is with the prime time double pack, I think you get a guaranteed prime time player. Like I think it's a guaranteed prime time. For this one, we have a bunch of prime times. Specifically, we've got Victor Hedman, Blake Wheeler gets left, uh, Gallagher, Chara, Dubnik, Strom, Thomas, uh, Gagne, Chirar. Bunch of these beast cards, and obviously, um. The rest of the cards are going to be the same. I'm going to see if they did add any of these new Frosted Flakes. I think these are new Frosted Flake cards. I'm not sure. Yeah, I think these are new Frosted Flake cards. Um, uh, yeah, yeah, these 100% are. Uh, they got uh, Lucic, Tavares, Hall, Hart, Nushkin Hopkins. They got a bunch of these cards right now. And sorry guys for the sirens in the back. I, I don't know what's going on. Maybe prayers up for them. But let's go check out these packs that they basically released. And I'm, I'm, I'm a big fan of these packs. I, I think I told you guys yesterday. I said, guys, save your packs. I, I said everyone needs to um, save their packs. Plus, they added in a new master set player as well. So, obviously, this is the first pack we have here. We have a Black Friday Ultimate Choice Pack. Um, the pack probabilities are not on the screen. But um, it is select a total of 15 players over 5 rounds. At least 80 overall better. Okay what okay maybe definitely this okay this this is definitely not the right pack there's no way that you get 15 players you can select a total of 15 players and you get at least an 80 overall better the pack probably is 100 wrong here's the prime time double pack you get 13 player items with a uh with at least five players with two guaranteed prime time players so you get two guaranteed prime time players the market is 100 percent gonna crash first off let's go check out this new set they just dropped they dropped in a um a new uh, Frosted Flakes 90 overall uh, master set. We want to check that out because that's what we're here for. Here it is 91 overall elite uh, Nicholas Hansen set. You have to trade in uh, the Rogue BK jersey, number 27, and um, 11 collectibles to get the um, untradeable version of his card. Or uh, you can trade in um, 10 gold collectibles to get uh, his uh, untradeable. And then obviously you can get 12 for his uh, gold tradable cards. So uh, I want to see what team he actually plays on first because I want to see. Um, I did not mean to go on to Martin Bedour. I want to see how his card stats are looking like. So he plays on SHLB. Okay, want to go check out his card. Want to see if this card is good and you know, what kind of synergies he has. But overall, big. I told you guys he's gonna update a lot of these cards. I called it, man. I, I'm not trying to play god right now i'm not trying to brag but i told you guys save your card so let's go check out the shl and uh let's go check out this card they they, they just dropped this card um where is he it should be in here if i'm not mistaken and um i swear to god i said it said bk did not nah, i'm 100 percent tripping let me go look for this card he was on rogue bk here it is so this has to be okay here is this card we'll go over the 91 90 overall version of this card first he's got howitzer and balance actually both of those synergies damn this is actually a pretty good card um he's 6-1 he's, he's right-handed he has 91 speed with synergies activated if you have um uh distributor i think that's gonna be what 94 speed 97 endurance 99 agility 88 acceleration 94 balance this card's gonna be a beast and look at those shot um, the sh shooting stats, he's got 99 slap shot power, 99 wrist shot power, 86 wrist shot accuracy, 86 wrist shot, uh, 86 slap shot accuracy. Good, good shooting stats for this card. Um, that's a really good card, man. That is a, uh, a, a very, very good uh, card. I'm a big fan of this card. Um, looking at all of his stats, I, I love this card. Um, I mean, yeah, this is a really good card. Let's go check out. Um, his one can it's basically let me see the stats are kind of the same Except you get an increased endurance 
So you get more endurance and I think more agility for this card. No, no, so the only the thing I think the only thing that increases in this is the um the um the endurance and I think something else increases, but again speed stays the same, but again, very good card. Um like I said before, if you're gonna make these cards, always try to make the tradable version. I know it costs 12 gold collectibles. Trade, uh try to make the tradable version. I would honestly prefer you guys to just make the 90 overall tradable version than doing this one because you can trade this one after you can sell it for coins. But again, the market right now, if you guys want to make coins, the market is going to be very horrible right now. The market is not good. I highly suggest you guys not sell. I mean, you guys should have been selling cards right now. Market, it's not good and it's not going to be good for a while. Okay, the market is trash right now. Uh, but here's the pack. Um, I I'm not a fan of these pack probabilities, man. Someone let me know in the comment section below because I'm not, I am making this video really early. Before, but this it, this pack doesn't feel like it's worth it. So you have 15 players. You can select 15 players, five rounds. So you have five rounds. You select 15 of them, um, meaning that you select three per round. Um, you have a chance. I mean, 80 overall or better. This that I'm not a fan of that pack with the price pack with the price of this pack. I'm not a fan of it. I'm just not um, a big fan of the pack the this pack the prime pack i'm actually a pretty big fan of this pack you get a guaranteed two prime time players there might be a chance you can get i don't know if this is current prime time players or if this is every single prime time player someone needs to let me know in the comments if because if this is every single prime time in the game ever released this pack's 100 percent worth it because of um there's some really good prime times that you can get i mean i think there's like the mcdavid the crosby but if this is still even if this is still only current prime times i mean for 30k this pack's worth it, and then this is the Black Friday Forever pack. You get three gold uh, guaranteed players. Right now, I think the Prime pack's the way to go, unless um, they change the odds. Because remember yesterday, they added, they changed the odds of these packs. These odds just aren't good. You're telling me there's a chance that I can only get 80 overall players. There's no guarantee I get something good. Not a big fan of this pack, if I'm going to finna be honest with you guys. Just not a big fan of this pack. Um, next up, we do have some hot challenges. Um... If you guys do want to uh, get the uh, Frosted Flakes, the new Frosted Flakes Master Set player, um, this is going to be how to get them. So you go into the weekday challenges, um, you play this one right here. Uh, you play this one, you block a shot, you get the pack, and then you can choose the number and the jersey um, to make the uh, the Master Set player. Obviously, we still have a bunch of cards to break down. I'm probably going to make a separate video breaking down the rest of these cards, but again, I'm not going to go full in depth, but here are all of the new Frosted Flake cards. We have Tavares, we have Taylor Hall. Drop a like, guys. Subscribe channel if you guys are new. Actually, before I do end off this video, I might as well show you guys the um, the new Frosted Flake cards that they just added instead of just ending off the video because I don't think that's fair to anybody. So they've added new Frosted Flake cards, obviously. Um, where is the Taylor Hall? I might have to make an updated version. Okay. <laughs> this Taylor Hall is going to be a beast out there. Look at his stats. I'm not going to go too in depth in these stats because, again, Stats are pretty simple. This is a nasty card um, to have on the team. Here is the distributor, John Tavares. This card is definitely going to be going for a lot on the market. Speed, even with distributor, does suck. He's 85 speed. Uh, is not the best, but, you know, it's, it's, not, it's not bad. But, again, he's got distributor. You can have him. Plus, he's got good face. So he can be a good fourth-line center for you. Um, that's not bad. Um, what so bit. Um, I think they also released Capo Caco, if I can find him. Um... Where is the other cards they released? I, okay, here's Nujkin Hopkins. Uh, Nuj, they released Nuj's card. Again, pretty decent card, right? They're not going to go too in-depth in them. And I think they did... This is a new Chris Phillips card. I, I'm not sure. Um, but there's a Phillips card. I, I haven't seen this card before, if I'm going to be honest. Where is... Um, here's Capo Caco's card, 84 of a speedster. Get him to 87. Those are the best cards. But again, you guys know the gist of it. Um... We also have the Milan Luce. He's not going to break him down. But again, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, remember, if we can hit 30 likes, I'm addicted. If we can hit 50 likes on this video, I'll do a pack opening. All right. Drop.